Hello, 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 and welcome to Total Mage. So, this came out a couple days ago on the 13th, and today is the 19th, and I'm not entirely certain why this has not been discussed a lot. So, a blog called MMOG Fails, which has been posting since 2013, and has to, all intents and purposes, a, a fairly large degree of credibility as to when it's posting, and the information that it's posting, put up an article on Monday, May 13th, titled Anthem is coming to EA Access and free to play is still on the table. The game sold almost 3.7 million copies. And based off the information in this very short post and the fact that the author of this does not claim that EA is going to make Anthem free to play, but that it's on the table and we all know it's on the table. If you don't think that free to play with Anthem is on the table right now over at Bioware and EA, you've drank the Kool-Aid. So the article goes on to give us numbers that they did not re release to us in their fourth quarter earnings, which was something that was very glaringly absent from the fourth quarter earnings call. Um, while they stated that it underperformed, they didn't actually tell us what the numbers were for uh, Anthem, and they didn't tell us what the numbers were for Apex Legend, which I find interesting. The author of MMOG Fails gives us the number of 3.7 million copies, which is quite impressive considering that PC Gamer was quoted as saying that Anthem was projected by EA to sell 6 million copies in its first 3.7 million days, which is absolutely an insane underperformance. Um, also there's some tidbits in the article about how leadership at Bioware is actually blaming the players. That's right, Bioware is blaming the players and the vitriol they spill. And the vitriol is in quotations, so I'm assuming that that's an actual direct quote from MMOG's source in EA. The vitriol they spill as the reasons why the game is not selling as well as it should. Yes, you're right EA. I hate video games. I want video games to suck. I want to just pick on video games. That's why I spend the vast majority of my free time playing video games. Oh man, seriously, like this is... Ugh. Man, you know, oh, I was going to say something political, but I'm not going to. We all know what kind of people these are. They're also blaming EA for saying the game can be patched later because of the games as a service model. Neither EA nor Bioware expected the pushback and hostility they received for delivering a product in such an unfinished state while selling it for a full price. This is an actual quote that this person is giving from someone inside EA, and this is their perspective. I'm sorry, EA, if you cannot own up to the fact that you said that you were producing this game for seven years, which you obviously were not, that you produced footage of this game at E3 that is not even remotely close to what was produced at the end when you sold us the game. I mean, it, don't even say for one second that this is because the community said that, oh, well, this is a games as a service model, and therefore, this game will not be complete. That is such a that is such a lie. That no one has ever, no one from EA has ever come out and said, Bioware is producing this game Anthem, and the game Anthem is not going to be completed. It's not going to be completed. We're going to release a partially completed game to you guys, and we just need you to understand that the $60 price tag and the seven years of development actually doesn't get you a completed game. What it gets you is a half-completed game, and we're going to complete the game over the next two years. Nobody says that. No one's ever said that with a, with a games as a service game. No one has ever said that. It's never even been implied. Games as a service means that you are going to release a game at a full price, and then you are going to release content for the game progressively over time, in addition to the video game. I know that's this crazy word, the video game, which would imply a completed product. You're going to add to that body of work over time, which is why you have microtransactions, which is why you have a gamer pass, all those things. Because games as a service is a guarantee, a guarantee of expansion. And expansion isn't completion. Expansion is an addition. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe the people running EA don't understand the basic definitions of words. I will link the, the article in the description below. Thanks as always for stopping by. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. To be quite frank, I take this 
blog with a little bit of salt, but at the end of the day, I really do look at this and say, yeah, this is pretty much accurate. Thanks for stopping by.